Everyone never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. There's my strapping husband. What do you think, hon? Beard or no beard? Thanks, Kazuwa. Of course, sir. Wow. That's right. Grognak the Barbarian in the Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. Nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. But then we're looking at a cold front coming down from Canada, making it crisp and dry for next week's Halloween festivities. Looking at next week's forecast, we have a high of 52 on Monday. Sugar bombs, 100% daily value of sugar. New Coca Cola, ice cold. Can someone so small drink so much? All the easier for our mechanized Hellcats to drive any screen. Mm. More the same. Can you get that? It's probably. Good morning! Vault Tech calling. Good morning. Isn't it? Just look at that sky out there. <clears throat> you can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. What's so important? Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language, the big kaboom is... It's inevitable, I'm afraid, and coming sooner than you may think. If you catch my meaning... Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a, um, mm -hmm, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Sounds great. Oh, it is. Believe you me. Now, you're already cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of uh, total atomic annihilation. <laughs> I just need to verify some information, that's all. Sure, let's do it. Splendid, splendid. Now, uh, <clears throat> let's see.
Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Mystery. Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that paternal affection you seem to be so good at. You heard Codsworth. Go on. How are the two most important men in my life doing? Spin the mobile a bit. He loves that. Hey, how's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're, uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with say? our affiliate stations. We do, oh, we no. do have, we do have coming in. That's, um, confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh my God. We, we need to get to the vault, now! Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. We need to get in. We're on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. You two, follow me. Come on. What's going to happen to all those people outside We're the doing gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Step on the platform in the center. Almost there. We're going to be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh my god! Hold on! They move faster? Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. This way, please. Yes, please proceed in an orderly fashion. This one's good. Step over to the table, take a seat. You'll need your suits before uh, we can take you further. Thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. See? This is our new home. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. It's gone. Our home. Everything we had. My Sir? mother and father down in D.C. Uh, how long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. The vault just seems just designed to be fashionable, as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future. 
right? Just step in here and put your vault suit on. Who's my little guy? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. There he is. See? Daddy's not going far. All set? Just step inside and put on your vault suit. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. <sighs> Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals. Procedure complete. In five, four, three, two, one. has to be a release! Come on, come on, come on! Oh, God! I'll find who did this. And I'll get shot back. I promise. Giant roaches? What the hell?
Where is everyone? I live and breathe. Oh, it's it's really you. My God, they did it. Those bastards really did it. Everything's dead. Everything's dead. Ah, yes, the gum. Mm. Uh, the posies have been uh, problematic, I admit. Ah, oh, if only the missus were here to help. Where is she, by the by? They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? He's gone. God damn it. Someone took him. Someone stole my son. It's worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> God damn it. Tell me what's going on. 200 years? 
That's insane. A, a bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little for the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. Oh, nothing. And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house and the car. The car! How do you polish rust? Stop it. Get to the point. Uh, I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were... dead. I did find this hollow tape. I, I believe the missus was going to present it to you. As a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. So this is all that's left? That's not all that's left, sir. There's still you and me. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The Mrs. and young Sean may turn up yet. All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, sir. Insect smashing time! Ah. I'm supposed I dare say I'm slightly. My senses are picking up movement in another house. Follow me! A waste of time. I only wanted to help, sir. But maybe you could try Concord. I've seen people in that area, and they're only slightly heavily armed. I like these people already. Oh, good. Maybe you'll get along then, and they can help you find young Sean. I shall remain here and secure the home front. That's it.
kommen, Buddy. Sweet. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? You want to come with me, pal? <laughs> okay, then. Let's stick together.
Up here, on the balcony. I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please! 